In this video, I'm going to show you an easy way to fix pain from a cervical herniated disc. Stay tuned. Hey everyone, Dr. Rowe here at Spine Care in St. Joseph, Michigan. So let's go over a very good conservative way to help relieve pain from a cervical herniated disc causing a pinched nerve in the neck, and that is traction. If you're unfamiliar with traction, this is how it works. So if we had x-ray vision, this is what our spine would look like. You have bone or the vertebra that comprise it, but you also have spacers in between those bones. Those are the spinal discs. Think of them as like a shock absorber. So when you do activities, you get into an injury or a fall, these are what take a lot of stress out of that. Like a shock absorber though, they can get compressed and overwhelmed. When this gets compressed, what happens is it starts to bulge off to the side. If it gets bad enough, it can actually herniate. A bulging uh, disc pinches a nerve, and that's when you start to get traveling pains down into the arm. So why traction is so great is because it's a pulling motion. So think if this is getting pancaked and compressed, what do we want to do? Exactly, pull on it. If we can pull on it, what we're going to do is create a negative pressure right here, bring that bulging material back in towards the center, off the nerve, and get a lot of pain relief and hopefully a lot less symptoms that are traveling. So let's give this a try and get you feeling a lot better right now. So how we're going to do this at-home neck traction is with an everyday hand drying towel. This is very easy and can give you pain relief in as little as 30 seconds. So with the first step, I'm just going to place the towel on my neck and I'm going to grab the two ends and I'm going to pull it forward until I feel a good stretch and a little bit of pressure into my neck. The next part is building uh, extension into the neck. That is bringing our head backwards like this while I keep pulling on it with the towel. It should make it actually feel better with this amount of traction. Do not go to the point of discomfort. So the next part, we're going to lift up on the ends right here to even get more traction into the neck. And I'm really gonna try to focus on bringing my head back as much as I can. This should make your neck feel better. It should not make it feel worse. If it is making it feel worse, discontinue immediately and instead go to your local doctor or chiropractor to get it taken a look at. So with this, I'm going to hold this for about 15 to 30 seconds. I'm going to then relax and then repeat about three to five times. When you do this also, you should get what's called centralization of symptoms. So if you have a cervical herniated disc into the neck that's causing a pinched nerve, you're going to get radiating or traveling pains, possibly from the shoulder into the elbow. If it's bad enough, it can go into the fingers. So with traction, when you pull on it, it's going to relieve that pressure into the spinal disc off that herniation, and you'll notice that symptoms should start to come back up to the starting point in the neck. So if you're not feeling as much traveling pain, this is working for you and keep it up. So if you are having one-sided pains that are traveling down, this is how we're going to take this to the next level and really focus on centralizing that pain. So with this stretch, what we're going to do is crisscross our arms like this. I'm going to pull on it just like before, but I'm going to keep one end locked while the other one goes up 45 degrees towards the ceiling. It's almost like you're trying to take this towel towards your uh, eye on that side. Keep pulling on it just like this. And what you're going to feel is that one side really starts to open up. And you want to go at an angle and just enough traction in there to hopefully start to get that to come back up. Try it on both sides. When you find a spot that is offering you the most amount of pain relief, that's the one that you're going to want to focus on. When you find that spot, hold it for 15 to 30 seconds, relax, do it three to five times. And I really do hope that it's going to give you a lot of centralization and a lot less symptoms traveling. So give it a try. I hope this helps. So if you liked the video and got a lot of relief, please show us your support by giving this video a like and maybe subscribing to our channel. If you have any comments or questions, please leave them below. I'll get back to you as soon as I can. Thank you for watching.